All right, guys. In the last episode, we failed to get the Champions League goal scoring record from Ronaldo, which is 17 goals, by the way, in one season. And the reason why I am so bothered that we might not get this is because real madrid is such a good team and there's every chance that i might not score in this match against them because we're going to the Bernabeu for the second leg and it's going to be so so tough to win that match but i really hope that we do but if we don't it's still going to be fine i'm going to be sad for a bit that we're out of the champions league and i couldn't uh, get what i wanted to which is the record but before the champions league match we have to focus on this match against tsg hoffenheim i'm going to be playing the highlights for it let me do the training drill real quick i really don't understand why that back line is literally always always changing either that or i just have a very shit memory it could be the latter because it's actually true i do have a very shit memory but let's go into the match and see if we can get another win in the bundesliga now if you are enjoying this current mode make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already there's going to be current mode and other stuff on next 25 daily so let's see what we have to do for this match all right we're starting with a counter attack again this is not a counter attack on god because how am i what that made no sense but we still come on we had the ball there what but anyways we have an attack and i am definitely not going to be i mean i should be able to but oh okay i can that is nice cut inside shoots and oh god all right so that is a very very Wait, what the fuck why is that my celebration but we have a crossing opportunity all right, I don't know if I go ahead out of that or not, to be honest, but that chance is gone. It's still 1-0. We have an attack. Am I with the ball here, though? I might possibly pass it to Brant if he can make a good run. Come on. Make the run. Please score it. And he makes it. He heads it. I mean, it wasn't... A header wasn't really far-fetched in that situation, but, I mean, he could have done way better than that. All right, Adiemi. I mean, that was, to me... But I mean, it was kind of weird because I did. I mean, he played it before I even called the pass. But anyways, we have a penalty here, and I need to work on my penalties actually because that penalty against Madrid that I failed that was really, really bad. I failed it out of nerves. I'm going bottom left until the keeper. Do All right, so we're missing penalties for fun right now, and we have a counter attack, another one. I mean, I really want to be able to like dribble past his defenders, but for some reason, I can't seem to do that. Marlin. Okay, nice. And let's see if we can support you immediately. Score. No, I can't. I mean, should I have passed on AME there? I don't know. But we do end up winning the match 1-0. That one goal is what led us to win the match. We got all of our objectives though, as well as the man of the match award. We we're also really close to getting a 10 point in that match. But sadly, we could not. But next up though, we have the match that decides if we are going to be going through to the quarterfinals of the champions league or not also decides if i am going to be um getting that goal score record because if we do not score and we still win i have like two extra chances because if konrad zan doesn't score and and we still win the match dortmund as a whole then we still have like two extra chances in the semi-final rather in the quarterfinals to get the to get the record so i'm really hoping that we do score in this match i really i really really want that record to be honest i mean we are 18 that is going to be a hell of a record on god because i don't think in a in, in a very long time i don't think anybody is going to be saying that an 18 year old like took the champions league record and holds the champions league record for like the most goals in a single season i mean that is really really far-fetched i mean it's not real life it's a game but like <laughs> still but the first leg ended as a goalless draw and it sets the stage for a really really tough match for us right now because we are at the Bernabeu and wait i just realized that it will be crazy if i get this uh record at the Bernabeu because Ronaldo got it at the Bernabeu if i'm not wrong i don't know if it was away or at home when he he scored that goal i mean it's it just it just like feels like something that will be really really um poet poetic if we actually do get the record in the Bernabeu but I mean let's just hope that that is the case oh the keeper made a mistake there and we still have the ball ah oh, shit no why the hell would you even try to pass to me there all right we have a good chance here and Adeyemi just completely fucks that pass up I don't even know like 
what's what is going on because i actually asked for him to like lob the ball to me i don't know why bro decided to like play on the bloody ground but oh well i think is madrid is keeping a high line as well so i mean we need to do something to be able to get past please score this and it's not even it's not even directed at me he just completely misplaced that pass i mean that's what i get from from a 77 rated right back but he did make the ball oh my god what's still with the ball back to Marlin. oh god please score it i'm offside oh my god oh my god that would have been i didn't even notice we were offside at all like that caught me off guard completely but i mean i mean we've tasted a goal already against madrid so i feel like that should like lift our morale a tiny bit i guess i mean we can't score against courtois that's what it shows please don't don't let them score after that that is a good oh okay, so wasn't a save it was it was wide all right can we try and score here and oh my god that would have been such a goal but Corto, i think Corto had that covered but it was it was wide of the post though all right that is a very good pass towards delicious but does he go out no he actually keeps it in oh my god and he gets past the defender all right so you guys you need to oh no oh no oh no all right that's a good save from Cobell. i mean it was shot directly at him but i mean some keepers would still be unable to get that but can we get a counter here please oh no oh my god what the fuck is that i mean he's so good at the set pieces but i mean he's, he, he won't actually claim the goal i think it's an own goal but uh that is just so unlucky that is just so unlucky now we have to equalize no matter what all right guys so we're not in a very good position to start the match and what the hell is that what the hell is that oh my god oh my god how the hell did they even let him do that all right so we have like 14 minutes to try and get a win here i mean it's not looking very likely especially after they have scored two goals they are probably going to i mean it's going to be really hard to like get get back into this game but i mean we should be able to do it well i mean this the, the attack is just so crazy like, look at vinicius all right that is good Schlotterbeck, thank you all right uh let's see what i can do here i can probably get marlin in behind Ah uh, no, that is not a very good pass. What the hell is that pass even? Oh no, oh no, this is going to be a goal, isn't it? Alright, so it's a good save from Cobell and damn, that is crazy. That was about to be 3-0 again. Nice. Alright, so we are not through yet, but can we? We just need to get past Gabriel, really. Not very good. I am actually actively messing up this match. That is like two really good opportunities that we could have have used to equalize if I actually like calm down and tied my my runs very well. Oh my god! Pass the fucking ball. What are you doing? All right, so it's looking good here. Can we? No, we can't. But Kortoa got that already, doesn't he? No, at times like this, I just wish. Oh my god! Oh my god! It's crazy that the defender was right in front of him there. He could have stopped him, but he just... That's the second time they're doing that shit. He could have stopped him, but he decided to let him... Oh, my God. Um. All right. So, obviously, we're not going to be getting the Champions League record unless we manage to score a goal at the end of the match. I'm not even really interested in it anymore because, I mean, what's the point of getting it if we don't win? All right. So, obviously, we're not going to be winning this match. I mean, there's no way in the hell that we're going to win this match. But I mean, I'm still trying to get myself a consolation goal. Maybe something of the sorts. Please just play it out to me. Oh my god. Alright, so we're looking at a possible... Counter. Or something. Oh my god, I'm offside already, aren't I? Of course. More offside again, right? Oh my god! The referee freaking hates me. I was not upside there, was I? I don't think I was upside there. Oh my god, that is so bad. So it's exactly what I feared that Real Madrid are going to absolutely demolish us in their home stadium. So I mean, we're not going to be able to get the top scorer in the Champions League this season. I mean, we're going to bow out of the competition with just 16 goals. That is really sad, but it's not looking like. I mean, I'm, I'm right now. I'm not feeling like Dortmund is going to be the team that would 
help us get the Champions League. Because looking at the team, apart from Oblak, me as Strachabek, Malin as well, maybe Brunt. I mean, the team just isn't Champions League winning quality. I mean, they did really well in real life last season. But I don't really think... I mean, it should be able to win it. Come on, like, what the hell is going on? I feel so sad, bro. We have 31 goals in the Bundesliga. That's interesting. Kane has now, like, taken his spot as second position. Gabriel did really well that much, actually. He actually did really well. All uh, right, let's look at what we have now. We're still in the League Cup, and that is against Leverkusen. So I'm, I'm going to play this one against them because we're pretty much in a good place in the, in the Bundesliga. So I don't really think that playing any matches is going to be of any help to me or anything like that but we're going to play the highlights for this match and then we would probably oh there's international match as international matches as well i think the world cup is pretty soon if i'm not wrong it's 2026 so it's definitely going to be this year but let's look at the calendar to see where the international matches are so we have friendlies against croatia and against sweden obviously i'm going to play those i'm going to simulate them probably going to simulate this one as well so we're going to be simulating three matches in a row and then we most likely will end the match against leverkusen here or something along those lines we had a pretty good match against them um, at the beginning of the season i think you, i think we got a hat trick in that match i'm not sure or we got a brace and an assist one of those two but we're going to be in their home stadium now and we should be expecting a really tough match from them this time around score at least one goal complete one pass i'm going to enhance the passing obviously and let's hope that we can get a win here our first order of business is the counter attack they're obviously going to pass this to me straight up so i best not like get on my bike marlin oh my god i was fucking daydreaming there what the hell what the hell was i doing all right so we have a good chance for a counter actually here i really hope that they can actually like play over he does all right that is good and uh, we get that in our stride not very well but can we and oh my god that is such a good goal that is such a good goal i don't really think that the keeper had a chance that that was all the way to the last corner next up is the cross opportunity and I, I might go oh that is brilliant that's brilliant but we just hit it wide or rather we hit it high nice 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 that is brilliant and we get a second goal that is such a good turn the way we turned jonathan tall there was crazy he is just experiencing that for the first time i don't think we did him like that in the last match and that that is just crazy sorry but stuff like this get my blood pumping like look at that that turn was crazy we did a little bit of handball there but i mean no one needs to know that that was handball right oh no it wasn't actually it wasn't but that is such a good turn i mean we did toss so dirty there i mean we almost didn't score that i don't know what the hell i was thinking but anyways we have another crossing opportunity let's hope that we can get something here we can't so we're gonna see a header against Jonathan Tarn. i don't even know what the hell i was thinking but now we have a counter attack and i don't know i'm not exactly confident in getting past three defenders exactly so we do win the match 2-1 thankfully that last goal that we scored there was helpful in us winning the match so we um get six points in total from our former club and it was a really good win we scored two more goals in the bundesliga and man we are flying i also need to check what the um, bundesliga goal scoring record is all right so most goals in a single season is robert Lewandowski with 41 of course i knew it was Lewandowski. i just didn't know how many goals he scored so 41 goals in one season is actually crazy and then the all time in the bundesliga is 365 we're probably not going to be in the bundesliga long enough to actually get 365 goals i don't know if we might go and come back i don't know but i mean two more seasons in dortmund i mean we've spent two seasons already so that's going to be four seasons in total in the bundesliga and i actually want to get past these international matches quickly so let's see if we can win this match against croatia we do 3-1 do we score we do score actually in the fifth minute so finally we are scoring in the international simulations and we also got um how many an 8.5 match rating that is pretty cool i didn't check if i got a 10.0 in the match against um what's their face against leverkusen but i scored two goals there's every possibility that i might have gotten the 10.0 but i mean two goals is it's um kind of a far fetch we lose this match against Sweden. we do score as well though but 
sadly we lose the match it really doesn't matter though i mean it's freaking international friendlies so i mean it's not really adding to it's not even adding to my goal tally so it's really like the most pointless thing <laughs> basically but i mean it's not really pointless to play for your country to rep, to rep your country it's just that i would rather you know play the Bundesliga matches and the league matches and all that and we get yet another win in the Bundesliga we score but Adeyemi gets a brace that is good for him 3-1 is the result and we are looking really really good in the Bundesliga we are now 13 whole points ahead of Bayern Leverkusen dropped points as well that is bad for them FSB managed I didn't really think that they were going to like stay up in the top four for this long so they actually tried though they are um six points ahead of Leverkusen and Leverkusen and Bayern, sorry, Leverkusen and Leipzig are actually um, fighting for the um, fourth spot. So I would like to see how that battle actually goes later in life. But for the semi-finals, we're going up against Leverkusen. And in the finals, we're going to be going up against either Union Berlin or Osnabrück. I don't know if I pronounced that well, but sorry if I didn't. But anyways, now we have the match against um, Leverkusen again. So that's twice in one episode. That's crazy. So... I mean, I would really want to... Wait, how many goals do we have in the Bundesliga, though? We have 34 goals, so we need 7 more to match Lewandowski's record. I mean, it's something that we should be able to do easily. I mean, we have a couple matches left. I think the Bundesliga is 34 matches in total, if I'm not wrong. So we have about 7 more matches to play to get 7 goals. So I think we're definitely... We definitely should be able to do that. I mean, we're freaking Conrad now. We score like 2 goals in every match. <laughs> so I mean, it's something that we should easily be able to do. Alright, so the match against Leverkusen is now. And this is going to be a tough match. I think we actually defeated Dortmund in the semi-finals to play against Bayern in the finals. That was last season. So right now, am I going to be in the opposite? team and getting revenge i mean it's going to be fun let's see if we can get a win in this match and move to the finals of the um dfb pokal all right so head in the game we are now ready for the match against our former club this is the third time we're playing them this season we have defeated them twice already i mean are they going to be hungry for that last defeat hopefully we actually do beat them but we kick off here at the buy arena and well I really hope that we can get a win here. All right, so I'm not going to lie. Their attack is actually pretty dangerous. And, you know, them playing right in front of my box is really, really freaking scary. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. How did they even let that happen? How the fuck did the defender let that happen? They were legit just looking at them. We were looking at Hoffman just walk into the post and shoot the boy to the net. I mean, I don't understand how the fuck that happens. I mean, he tried to shoot. There was a block. And then bro just let him. Oh, my God. Uh, that is so annoying. Right, so that is brilliant all right so we are probably through on goal here can i score this yes i can and all right so that is game on baby that is game on baby i forgot to check what the hell my celebration was but that was a really good um goal i honestly was thinking that the keeper was going to get it because that was a really tight angle but apparently not and now they have a corner which means it's a possible chance for a counter attack for our team and I really hope that that is the case. All right, so we do get the ball out. All right, so, I mean, we have the pace, right? Okay, so the guy pretty much fucked himself up there. But getting past Jonathan Ta is the problem. And oh my God, I did that too early. I did that too early. We had a chance to go 2-1 up. And I just like botched that completely for my team. Oh my God, I don't believe that happened. All right, Maris is still in this team. And he's going to be trying to pass. I can bet. All right, that is good. That is brilliant. All right, come on. That is good. Can I get a, an assist here? Maybe. Please score it or not. All right, so the keeper does make a good save there. I mean, I probably should have called back for the ball because, I mean, we're looking like we're in a good position for that. All right. Come on, get to me. Power shot, maybe. Normal shot this time. And that is blocked by Jonathan Ta And it goes out for another corner. So let's see if I can actually do what I wanted to do. All right, maybe. All right, so we don't get. I mean, I don't know why they don't play that corner to me. Well, I don't know why, because I really want to like hit that thing on, like one time. The power shots. He okay, cuts back. Let's go out wide. Uh, let's see if he will be able to get this to me. And oh my god, what is that? What the fuck is that? Come on, stay with him. Don't let him make any pass. All right, that is actually kind of deep. Oh, my God. Oh, Jesus. All right, I think that is pretty much it for the first half, I guess. 
Yeah, exactly. So that is that has been a really good match. They scored pretty early. We replied like immediately. And I mean, we're just showing them that we are we are their bosses in this match. I mean, we're just the better team on paper. I don't think we're the better team on paper, though. But like, uh, my team is just doing way better than them in this match. But let's hope that we can actually see that all the way to the end of the match and actually get ourselves a win here. All right, come on. Maybe. All right, that's brilliant. All right, who's there? Marlin, maybe? Oh, shit. He wasn't. Oh, my God. That is such a good shot. Can you get this back out to me? You can't. And we do get a header on it, but the keeper makes a good save. I think it was just creeping into the back of the post. But let's try this one more time. Schlotterbeck, come on. And he does get a header on it, but it is um, caught by the defender, which is kind of weird. All right, nice, nice, nice. All right, so we're through here. This is probably a goal, and it is. Yes, all right, that is 2 0. All right, 2 1. And we have our second goal in the DFB Pokal semi finals. And well, that is a really good goal. I mean, I was going to pass, but I was like, hmm, what if Tar just like is not really knowing exactly what I'm going to do next? And I just like caught into his side. And well, I mean, he was there was no catching me from there on. Oh my god. All right, so let's hope that they just go here, which they do. And that is just so sad. That is just sad. I don't know how the hell they just tore open the defense like that. And that is also a really good finish from Adam Thuram or Marcus Thuram. I don't know what his first name is, but it was a good finish from him, nonetheless. All right, Marlon, can you score this? You can't. Keep on making a good save. And it goes out for a corner. And we have another chance to get Schlotterbeck a goal. If he can make the header, he doesn't. All right, can we go for... Oh my god, we hit the fucking post. Alright, so we're almost at the end of the match. It's just 10 minutes left and they are playing us like a fiddle. I swear to God, if they score here, I'm going to be I'm going to be devastated. Because I mean we're going to be going out of two two cup matches. Which isn't really my plan. Adiyemi, come on. Oh shit. That's my bad. I, I took I took a heavy touch there. Uh we probably might need to get past alright, that's brilliant. Oh, we still make it. We still make it. Please score it. Please score it. Oh my god, he doesn't score it. Oh my god, he doesn't score it. I am I am at a loss for words. And how do you fucking not trap that? Alright, so it's the end of the normal time. I think we're going to extra time. I don't know if we're going straight into penalties. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh my god. That was so scary. Alright, so we're almost at the end of the first half of extra time. And it's not looking like... I mean, nothing really happened. We've just been going back and forth with possession. I'm looking for a miracle, but it's not looking like something is going to happen in this half. Maybe in the second half. Or we might just go all the way to penalties and, like, you know, hope that we actually go through to the finals of the DFP Pokal. All right, that is a good interception. Please, come on. That's not a very good pass, though. Kari, my name, what the hell are you doing, man? Please, score this. Please, I take on... Oh, my God. That's the second time they're doing this shit. That's the second bloody time they're doing this shit. All right, this is looking very dangerous. I mean, if he crosses this, it might be over for us. Oh my God, Kobel. All right, that's brilliant. All right, get this out to someone. Get this out to someone. Do not waste my time. Oh my God. Please. Nice. All right. Can you hear me? Come on. All right, you are through. You are through. Please score this. I beg you. <sighs> Finally. Finally. I mean, I completely just, like, took the hat trick out of my head. I mean, I was literally passing to everybody at the end there, because, I mean, I needed to win this, but I do not want to go to penalties. I hate penalties in this game so much. So, I mean, I, I mean, we still do win it. That's a really good finish from, from Adeyemi. I, I don't know why the hell he did not score the last time. But, I mean, we finally did it, and I don't think that Leverkusen is going to be able to get back. To win this i mean it's long gone for them i mean last kick of the ball maybe and exactly all right so we do win the match we make it to the finals of the dfb pokal that is going to be in the next episode which is the season finale and i mean i wish that i was still in the champions league but sadly that is not the case maybe next season who knows and i mean to be honest i don't think dortmund will actually um have what it takes to get to the finals of the champions league this dortmund team though so i mean i can only hope that that's what happens because I'm going to like spend two more seasons in this team before I leave to another team or something like that. And hopefully we can win as much as we 
as we should. All right, so that was a good match. Did we get a 10 point there? We got a 9 4. We got two goals and an assist there to win the match for the team. Adeyemi has been included among the Bundesliga Player of the Month nominees alongside Kane, Faraz, and Zan. I think I'm going to take that. I don't think they are going to take that though. Next up, we have the match against Freiburg. And we do win the match. The big win 4 1. Do we score? Yes, we do. So that is one more goal in the Bundesliga. I think that is um, now six goals that we have to score. Have left to score before we like get to Lewandowski's record. All right, so Frankfurt is a team that I really don't like because they took me out of action for five months. And I mean, I'm still holding that grudge. And we already beat them like a lot this season already. A hat trick at that. And I can't believe I, I mistakenly like uh, played the full match of this. All right, that is exactly that is this is not what I planned to do. Honestly, I just restarted the game because I really couldn't be asked playing another full match in this episode. So let's hope Karim Adeyemi can. All right, so we still are with the ball. Can you get this to me? Okay. All right, to Malin. Okay, that's not what the hell. What does out of zone even mean? That is just stupid. All right, so I want to do a power shot here, or I might just do a normal shot. And it doesn't work out. We're still with the ball, though. All right, dear me. Thank you. Please score this. Please score this. Please. <laughs> Why the hell do you use your head? Of all things, you use your fucking head. That is crazy. All right, so we have a crossing opportunity this time. And I believe that this ball is not going to zoom out of the pitch. All right, it's not. That's good. Outer foot maybe and the keeper does save it. That's really that's a really good save. Can I score like this? Uh the keeper makes another save. Alright, I'm trying to score because I'm trying to chase after that record. But we have a counter attack here. I think we need to score this so that um um we can actually get that cane. Oh my god, what is that? What the hell is that? What the hell is that? That is just beyond irritating, to be honest. We don't score. Sad. Of course, it's when we're actively chasing the record that we do not score a goal. But anyways, that draw actually sees us home 10 points ahead of Bayern. I mean, they can still win it if we lose every single match from here and out. But I don't really think that is possible. It's just five more matches though before the end of the season. And we have done absolutely amazing. We're chasing the records right now. And even though we do not like get to um meet any of them even though that might not be the case i mean we're still we've still done really really well in this in this season 58 goals in 40 appearances we still have five more matches six more matches in total to play i mean that is the finals of the dfb pokal and then the five more matches in the bundesliga so last season we won just the dfb pokal and we fell short of the of the bundesliga but this time around we possibly might get the two trophies in one goal so we might get the domestic double i'm really really looking forward to that but anyways this is the end of the video if you have enjoyed it make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel if you have already turn on the post notifications so you will be notified of when i drop new videos let me know in the comments what you think about the series and i'll see you in my next video peace